In 2004, Claudia Mitchell's life changed forever. I was in a motorcycle accident when I lost my arm. It didn't take long for Claudia to realize that prosthetics on the market weren't what she needed. It became a mission to be able to give back and participate in, in things that were going to bring about change and bring about better prosthetics. For more than a decade, Claudia has been part of a research trial led by Cleveland Clinic's Dr. Paul Morasco to create a cutting edge prosthetic that allows her to feel sensation as if it's coming from her missing hand. There's losses on multiple levels when you lose a hand. Not only do you lose the movement and the ability to grab things, but then you lose the ability to, to feel and to engage with people. Claudia was one of the first to have sensory nerves that once led to her arm and hand rewired to muscles in her chest. Essentially just unplugged one phone jack and put in another one and here, so now here on my chest I feel my hand. Claudia's brain interprets the arm like it's her own. When she thinks about moving her hand, the muscles on her chest twitch and send signals to control it. And when she holds or touches something, she instantly feels it when the fingertip sensors in her prosthetic hand are activated. It's just really simple, small things that don't sound like a big deal, really are. When I put on my mascara and you go to close the lid, you know when you're done closing the lid because you can feel the tube start to turn and then you're finished. I didn't know that before. Well, now I can feel that. Now, there's a lot of what's called neuromuscular retraining involved in this. Claudia has to teach her brain to twitch chest muscles to move the hand and also how to interpret the touch signals coming back. And if the fingers have temperature sensors, she could even feel heat and cold. She's a Marine Corps vet. One of the reasons she's so involved in this project, yeah. she wants to give back to her fellow vets, the ones who have also yeah. lost limbs.